This is Paul? Yeah. This is common law. Yep. City of Auburn versus Solis Marcel, 119 Washington App 398. Yes. This, the state legislature didn't pass this as a law? No. The governor of the state of Washington didn't sign this as a law? No. This was, um, this is common law. Yeah. The body of rulings. Yeah. <laughs> that have been made by judges on the basis of community customs and mm, previous court decisions. Yes. Mm -hmm. And this judge, yes, or the city of Auburn or whomever it was, yeah, states, yeah, the intent of the Domestic Violence Protection Act is to protect the victims of domestic violence <laughs> and communicate the attitude, yeah, <laughs> that violent behavior is not excused or tolerated. Yes. Mm -hmm. um, what was the specific act or threat of violent behavior that um, <clears throat> that I was accused of? The arrest that took place on Guam, <clears throat> being homeless, yeah. not paying child support, oh, not doing a mental health evaluation. <clears throat> I just wanted to know the violent behavior that <clears throat> is not excused or tolerated <clears throat> to mandate personal service as a further requirement of the offense of violation of a protection order. Yes. Personal service as a further requirement of the offense of violation of a protection order <laughs> would undermine the legislative intent, the civil law, yeah, by creating an incentive for domestic violence perpetrators yeah, to avoid court appearances and avoid personal service. Yeah. Now, it doesn't say anything about the petitioner. No. It talks about um, mm, perpetrators, mm, defendants, respondents, yes, the individuals that don't have to be served and mm, if there's an accusation of domestic violence or child abuse they can be arrested mm. but the thing is it says here that the protection order was issued yes was she there oh did she sign it right now did the petitioner petition the court for uh, a protection order mm -hmm. because of a specific threat or act of violence that was alleged against the respondent. Yes. See, you're using common law. Yes, yes. But it is not. Uh -huh. It does not yes. have anything to do with my personal life. Yes. When I told you that these allegations of due process violations, yeah. and I gave you what the law says, as I've done today, yes. and you said these RCWs are not enforceable, <clears throat> You usurped the legislatures of every state of the United States. Now, I don't know what this individual's personal life is. Yes. But somebody's been given this to prosecuting attorneys right now. In fact, I think that you have kind of been picking through yes. the various court decisions. Yes. So as to win your cases. Mm -hmm. So that you would not have to acknowledge the civil laws of each state. Yes. Or the civil laws of the Congress of the United States. <laughs> Now, for the individuals that have to prosecute because of arrest, right now, prosecuting attorneys, yes, elected to office, yes, any knowledge, violate, foul, foul, 